Pilgrims from Brooklyn and Queens visit St. Patrick's Cathedral, but not the one they're familiar with in Manhattan. It's very, um, very different from St. Patrick's in, in New York. The Dublin site is believed to be where the 5th century saint baptized converts. This carved stone is said to have covered the well St. Patrick used to welcome newcomers into the church. He built the faith back to the Irish people. Pilgrims pray to see the Irish people build the faith again. Decades ago, 90% of Irish Catholics filled the pews across the country. Today, it's down to 30%. Many wish the Holy Father's message this weekend brings the faithful back to the church. My hope is that uh, Pope Francis's visit to Ireland will help to you know, reignite that faith um, to strengthen those who are believers. Father Christopher Henu heads the Irish ministry in the Brooklyn Diocese. He says St. Pope John Paul II warned worshipers about the decline of Catholicism when he visited Ireland in 1979. During Mass, the Holy Father addressed issues that have affected the church. He spoke in that homily 40 years ago about uh, the sanctity of marriage. He spoke about the sanctity of human life. He spoke about vocations to the priesthood. And each one of them has been challenged very much so here in Ireland. Now, these pilgrims hope for a restored faith in the country just as St. Patrick did centuries ago. Go back to the old roots, find your roots, and start back from that. In Ireland, Tim Harfman, Currents News.